What's more manly than growing a big, beautiful beard? Well, nothing. Except making your own beard bomb. Now, you might ask yourself, how am I going to make my own beard bomb? Well, stay tuned, and I'll show you. Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. So I've been growing my beard out since November of last year. And one thing I think is a little underrated is a good beard bomb. I've been using this beard butter by Fresh Beards and it works really well. I'm almost out of it. It's about $25 for a four ounce tub of it. So it's fairly expensive. Um, before I ordered another tub of this, I thought it would be pretty easy to make your own beard bomb. I found a really good recipe on themanlinesskit.com. A good beard bomb will keep your beard moisturized and it also gets rid of the itch. I know a lot of people have a big problem with the itch under the skin when they start growing their beards out. So really a good beard bomb takes care of all that. Okay, so the first ingredient is going to be beeswax. I use this uh, ivory organic beeswax pellets. The beeswax is what's going to harden when it cools off. So we need two tablespoons of the beeswax. Okay, the next ingredient is gonna be a butter. Um, some people use cocoa butter. I chose to use shea butter, so I use this unrefined shea butter. So you need two tablespoons of your butter. Your butter is also what's gonna make it uh, melt down in your hands. So I've got my butter and my beeswax in here. Oh, I just need to take it over to the stove. So it's all melted down now, and basically the recipe calls for 10 teaspoons of carrier oils. Your carrier oils are what's going to give you nutrients to your beard and what's going to keep it moisturized. Argan oil is one of the best oils you can use for your hair or skin. So I'm going to put 4 teaspoons of argan oil. Next I'm going to use some sweet almond oil. I'm gonna do four teaspoons of that. For the last two teaspoons, I'm gonna use this grapeseed oil. Lastly, if you want your beard balm to be a little bit scented, you gotta use some essential oils. This one, I'm gonna use this uh, sweet orange and lime and see how that turns out. All right, and it really it really doesn't take long for this stuff to start to set up. It takes about 15 minutes and you'll see it start to turn white. And then after it hardens, it's good to go. Now I plan on using up some of this stuff. I've got 12 tins left, so I'm gonna make a few more batches and fill up the tins.
Okay guys, so it's all set up. I ended up making five different batches. I doubled up a couple of the batches to save a little bit of time. I filled 14 tins and I think it took me maybe, maybe about an hour, a little over an hour to do that. There's several advantages to being able to make your own beard bomb. I filled 24 two ounce tins of this stuff with about $60 worth of products. So huge saving factor. If you guys like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. Add us on Snapchat for some behind the scenes action. And we'll see you in the next video.